It's surfing time. Jesse just got injured on a surf. <laughs> do you want to, yeah, you want show, to show everyone? I think it was a fin. And it cut through your wetsuit. Ow! I'm surprised it didn't. Oh my god. Cut through my massive shoulders. <laughs> Peas on Peas. it. Peas. Earlier I tried checking the surf and we're literally in a cloud, you can see it. And I checked it and I couldn't see anything. So I was like, I'll just wait. I'll just wait. And now there's a couple surfers in, so we better go. Quick. But Jesse's injured, so he's gonna um ice it for like, I don't know, a couple minutes and then he's gonna film me. I'm in my four three. Even though I'll probably be a bit toasty. I cut my wetsuit the other day. The fin went into my knee. Can you see? There's literally a hole. Oh, and, th and through the other side of the hole is my scab, where it's scabbed up. That's so gross. I will see you in the surf. Is surfing not that inviting when it's cloudy and rainy and like <laughs> I am such like a sun surfer like as soon as the sun's out I'll be in the surf but as soon as it's cloudy I'm just like <laughs> I'm just like I don't want to go in cool how am I meant to survive English winter when I'm not keen on surfing when it's like cold and gray how is this gonna happen? Jesse's just taken my board off the car. We've just arrived. It is Tuesday afternoon. We're gonna go for an afternoon, like evening surf. Um, it's really high tide right now. There's like one other surfer out and the car park is pretty much empty. So we could catch some fun ones. I got Jesse like doing doing everything. Cause I was like, oh, I'm gonna chat to, the, to you guys. And now he's just taken my board off the car. Little life hack there girls, if um, if you're a vlogger, just say, I've got a vlog, I'm so busy, I've got a vlog, and then they'll just get ready for you. Like, they'll get everything ready for you. We'll hack that. Is it good? Mm. I've had a shower, come back from a surf, it's what time, like 9.30 or something? Which is so late, which is mm. not. I don't like eating late, but anyway, we got potato wedges, guacamole that Jesse made, some coleslaw, and a lovely burger. This is gonna fuel us after our surf. And I burnt like 600 calories on my surf, which is pretty crazy. I didn't realize surfing you burnt that many calories, but I'm able to know because I borrowed Jesse's Apple Watch, and on it he's got, um, an app called Dawn Patrol and you can like record your surfs and you can see like how many calories you burnt, how many waves you caught and it also tracks like your waves and your times so that it like links up to Surfline and then you can go back on Surfline and watch your waves on the webcams. I didn't know that was a thing so it's pretty cool. Um, so I saw a couple of my waves Jesse showed me. I'm pretty tired I'm just gonna eat this we're gonna watch some only murders in the building and then just go to sleep and then tomorrow we're gonna go skate if the weather permits okay <laughs> October to walk 50k. I don't like to run so I'm just gonna do the walking challenge. It's a challenge on Strava which is this like fitness app 
and I was like, you know what? I'm gonna do the 50K walk this October and it seems pretty doable, but I haven't walked in a few days now. So I feel like I have to catch up. I did some yoga this morning, which felt really good. I've got like an injured foot from skateboarding. I injured it at Mount Hawk, which is this like indoor skate park. I, I don't know what I did. I can't even remember how I hurt myself. I just remember it really hurting. And I had this massive bruise on my ankle and it swelled up loads. So I had to ice it and stuff, but it still hasn't like fully recovered. So when I'm doing yoga, it can really hurt. I don't know what I did. <laughs> so it's okay when I walk. It's just when I'm like stretching it out. I think it's just a bit tight. I must have like sprained it or something. So Look how wet the skate park is. We're literally doing a skate park crawl and we're just checking out all the local skate parks. Look at this, I can like practice my turns, like that corner, which I can like mimic a wave. So this is honestly so good for surf training. And I'm really trying to get better at my cutbacks and my turns on a longboard. And I just find that surf skating is such a good way to train. The progress is almost instant. I would go on a surf skate, practice my turns, then the next time I go in the water, I just feel like a massive improvement and difference. So if you are contemplating whether to get a surf skate, I would 110% recommend it. And the one that I use is a carver skateboard. Um, it started to like drizzle a tiny bit. I'm just putting on all my pads and then I'm going to skate it up. Oh, nice. Oh, whoa, what the hell? <laughs> Woo! <laughs> this is so fun because we've got the skate park all to ourselves. If you can go to a skate park in the middle of the day when all the kids are at school, that's like the best time to go. Good morning! I feel like I'm half asleep still. It's like quarter to nine. It's not even that early, but I'm on a walk. Woo. I'm having a skate break. I've got a headache. I rolled in on a really steep like ramp, which I'm quite proud of. And I'm getting way more confident on the balls. So yeah, feeling good about that. I'm here with a bunch of girls and it's been really fun. The, the skate park is so busy, look at it. I mean, this isn't even its busiest, but there's just loads of um, kids scooting around and they're just so fast. Getting a bit tired now. Got a headache, so I just thought Powerade will help me through this. I am so hungry. I didn't eat today. I haven't eaten since breakfast. And I had porridge. And then I skated for like three or four hours. And now I'm back home and it is 7.53. I'm running on empty, guys. Um, but I'm just gonna stretch. I'm gonna stretch out and have a shower and then eat and then that is my amazing Saturday over with. I've had the best day. It was so fun. Dinner is served. Look at that. Massive bowl of chili, rice, guac, cheese, mayo. Oh, it's so good. It's so good. Oh. Jesse's here. Hi. Say hello to the vlog. Hello. <laughs> we're so tired and hungry. Okay, we're gonna eat this. And watch, only murders in the building. <laughs> I didn't feel like coming on a walk today just because it's so cold. But I'm going for a walk in the forest and look how beautiful it is. So I'm very glad I kind of like pushed myself to actually go on a walk. And also I was like, I've got to get this 50k done this month. Today's a really big day. I am launching my first ever surf retreat. When I get back home, I'm gonna to talk to you all about it because I really want you to join. And it's gonna be so fun. I am so excited. I'm also nervous because this is my first ever launch of a surf retreat. So I'm pretty nervous, but let's just 
finish this walk and then I'll talk to you when I get home. I'm feeling very lucky and grateful right now. Like, the sea. Look at that. It's like, I have the best of both. I have countryside, which I love, like all the fields, the farm animals, and then I have the ocean and like waves. Like, come on. <laughs> I'm just like, how did, how did I do this? How is this my life? <laughs> How cool is this? I don't know, I just wanted to share my little walking route with you. It's just so amazing. And I never see anyone on my walks. <laughs> it's just so quiet and like secluded, but it's nice. Like, look at this viewpoint. Jesse has tried to surf down there, but it's too risky, like trying to get down. You have to stumble down the cliff. So wouldn't recommend, but it's nice to look at. I just walked up a massive hill, but yeah, I finished my walk. Here are the stats. Do you want to surf for seven days in the most beautiful surfing location in Portugal? I'm hosting my first ever surf retreat in collaboration with Inspired Ventures. They are an adventure seeking travel agency who collaborate with content creators like myself. And we have curated the most perfect surf retreat that I could ever dream of. It's open to everyone, male, female, couples, whoever, you can join for seven days. We'll have five group surf lessons, three yoga sessions. We will even have access to the skate bowl. So bring your skateboard or you can hire one there and we'll have surf video analysis, a surf photographer. And the best bit is that we are gonna be staying in massive luxurious surf villa all to ourselves. We've even got our own pool so we could practice like duck dives, turtle rolls, like whatever, or just lounge by the pool and tan and it's just gonna be so fun I am so excited so if you want to book this trip it's gonna be in Eracera Portugal in May 2024 the 3rd to the 10th for a whole week you'll be spending it with me and we'll just be surfing skating yoga like it's gonna be so much fun I am so excited so if you want to join there is a link in my video description and you can book check it out look at the itinerary see if it's for you but this is for like any surf level any skill like if you're a complete beginner that is fine we're gonna have surf lessons i'll also help you if you want it's gonna be so fun so i'm so excited click the link in the video description to see more details about it if you have any questions or you're interested but you don't know i don't know you just want to find out more you can just dm me on instagram if you want you can even comment them on this youtube video as well and i can answer them there but i'm super excited I hope you can come. I'd love to see you there. So if you're interested, click the link in the video description. I love you all so much. Like your support is amazing. And thank you so much for following me and subscribing to this YouTube channel and following me on social media because Without you, I wouldn't be able to do these things that I can do, like these surf retreats and host them for you guys as well. So this is a dream come true and I couldn't have done it without you. Honestly, your support is amazing. And yeah, thank you so much. Like I am so grateful for you. You guys are honestly amazing. And yeah, I just, I love you all. But I will see you in the next video. Bye. And book the surf retreat. Okay, bye.